Hi, sweet friends. Welcome to Tea Time with Elizabeth. I have a cool shirt for you today. Who's your farmer? Um, this shirt goes back, to, gosh, many years. Um, and it's from Sweetwater Organic Farm in Tampa. It was a farm that I used to volunteer at um, to run their Sunday market. And they had a CSA which is a community supported agriculture. And each week uh, we had members that would come in, they buy in usually the season before um, to be a member and they could pick up weekly their produce um, collection or every other week and they could come grab their produce depending on um, which one they signed up for. And so I would run the Sunday market where we would sell additional things and this Sunday market uh, led me to open a food co-op. Um, and so what that was is I would purchase from a local distributor, organic produce, and I would drive to many different spots in the area to provide uh, as much local um, fresh organic produce to um, my community. And it was called Lettuce Heads Organic Co-op, and it was so much fun. It actually led me to um, cooking classes. Um, and I started doing cooking classes at a functional medicine doctor's office. And I just got to share clean eating recipes, um, a little bit about exercise and mental health and kindness, <laughs> loving each other. Um, that led to cooking classes at a local um, health food store, a, a grocery store, uh, which was so much fun. And then in turn led me to creating Sweet Elizabeth's Organics. And now here we are. Um, so healthy food, organic food has been a very important part of my life for many years. And it's knowing where your food comes from, knowing what's in it, and choosing the most nutritious food um, possible. Um, the reason that why I've been eating organic is uh, the, it's the best thing for myself, my family, and for our health. And, um, you know, we're bombarded all day by different toxins and chemicals. And it's in, it's in our yards now. Most of my neighbors spray their yards. And, um, you know, it's in the air that we breathe and in the furniture. It's in our cars. It's all over the place. So if you can slowly start taking away those toxins out of your life, um, the better off you're going to be because your body will begin to be overloaded by them and um, it's harder for your body to detox when there's been so much um, that it's overloaded with. Um, so that's a big reason of why we choose to eat organic and that's why our bakery is organic as well. And I would say um, all of our mixes are made with organic ingredients, um, except for our baking soda is not certified organic and neither is our salt. Um, but nine, and then 98% of what we serve here at the bakery is also organic. Um, and uh, when it's in season, I buy our greens from a local uh, farmer. And um, he actually farms the front yards of his neighbors, which is so incredible. So not only is he um, getting rid of pesticides and herbicides and chemicals in his neighborhood, um, but he's also able to provide his small community with fresh produce, which I just find um, amazing. And man, do his greens taste incredible. So just wanted to share a little bit about why we are organic and um, where it all started. So um, just remember to check out um, your local health food store, um, look for a community supported agriculture or an organic farm. Um, and then we also have in the Tampa area, it's uh, Abby's, which is a, a natural grocery store here. Um, they've just started a little farm where people can come in and um, 
donate a little bit of money and get their own uh, gardening plot. And so you're learning gardening, you're learning about um, watering and how to save water and, and, and how to grow um, your produce organically, which then just leads to the next generation and to the next generation. So um, I'm sure there are many resources in your area if you're not in the Tampa area. Um, and so just feel, reach out to friends, um, put something out on Facebook. I'm sure that there are many resources out there for you to find. So thank you for joining me. I hope you have a wonderful week. Much love and happy baking. Thank you, friends. Bye.